Strength. Oh, where's that invasion at? It's usually on the coast somewhere. I don't know where it's at. He was just slapping that dude while he was on the ground. Just no respect. None. So, yeah, let's look at all the characters I have left. I think I'm going to be missing. No, I got Thing, too. I just went nuts. I bought all the really cheap characters <laughs> and got one expensive character. I'm gonna be uh, making some some uh, video guide, leveling guides for this game since I'm so fascinated with it right now. See how. Uh, See how the editing goes on those. So I'm gonna do Storm and um, Thor first. I might do Hulk. I mean, I like him so far. Let's see what what the response is like on those. Did I spend over twenty dollars? Oh yeah, I spent over. I don't know if you saw the first video. I already dropped thirty because uh, Thor was so expensive at the beginning, which is something I talked about um, in like my review of the game before they had the sale. Like, Thor was $15 just about, and so he was at, he was in a position where you, you could either go uh, 1,100, well, how many points did they give you? I think they give you 1,100 points and he's 1,200? It's, it's real shysty. Like, uh... So, I mean, you don't want to go, let me buy the $9.99 and then buy the $5.99 pack, which would give you that. So it's like you might as well just get 20 So I dropped $20 on it, and I was like, all right, let's do this. And then um, I think I put another 20 in or so. So I'm like at about 40 But I figured since uh, since I invested some money in it, I might as well get my fill. Play a lot of the characters and uh, yeah, get and uh, make some videos for it. It's like, why is my 3 not working? I forgot I didn't actually level that skill. That beach is cleared.
I think the cool thing now is I started leveling, like looking at what the character's abilities were, and because I have enough time vested in Thor, I can kind of get a general sense of what is useful on Hulk. And so I was looking at how I built him up so far, and it's basically on par with uh, some of the best build guides for Hulk already. At least on the forums anyway, so. Seems like they need to expand a little bit on their uh, their viability of builds. Because I pretty much understand what what will work and what won't work now. Which is seems like people on the forums are on their forums are having mixed feelings about the I guess balance. I don't want to say balance. The variety viability of different characters based on their abilities. So I hope I grab Cap. Yeah, I got Captain. I got uh I, wonder, I can't remember if I got thing on the drop now, but I, I got uh, one expensive character that I wanted, which was Iron Man. I was I wanted to get Iron Man and Spider Man, but on the deal they just didn't lower it low enough for me to feel like I was going to spend that much money on those two characters. So I just took Iron Man, and I got uh, Hulk. I got uh, let's see. Captain, Cable, and Wolverine, I think, is who else I got. But Wolverine might have been a drop. I can't remember now. These? What's up, dude? I'm assuming that's how you say your name. Could be Dies, but I'm going to say these. These days, days high, or is that an L? Dells, is that a, is that an L? Dells. Oh, Bronco, yeah. I mean, I I grew up playing so many different games. Like, I never really got stuck on. Uh, it's an L. Okay. You will die. You think guns make you tough? But yeah, I never really got stuck in one genre, although the competitive scene has really gotten me on shooters for a long time. But now that you know our team isn't playing anything competitively right now, it allows me to uh, play a lot more stuff that I really wanted to play and just haven't had the time to or couldn't quite get to. But yeah, I mean, I there was a time period where... I was playing Madden a whole lot. I grew up playing a lot of Madden. I played a lot of uh, uh, Pokemon. <laughs> I haven't, this, we used to do these weird things uh, when I was at my... This no, it wasn't weird, but we used to do stuff with my uncle. Um, he's, I'd say I I'd, I'd probably contribute my time with him as like my entry into competitive gaming because we used to uh, have lands where it would be my two cousins, his sons, basically, my brother, and him, and we would do these lands where at like Christmas break or Thanksgiving break or spring break, we would stay the night over his house like for like a week, and we would do these Madden leagues, and uh, man, it got super competitive. And he got me involved in a local uh, uh, Madden League there in it was Akron, Ohio, with the police force, and I whooped their ass <laughs> really bad. I used to beat those dudes like I don't know, like 113 to like 10. I would just go nuts. But that's why I mean I started like competitively with 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 Madden. Um, this is like. 1998 up until like 2003 I think 
but we then we started playing um, NFL 2K. We started doing MLB seasons, NBA 2K seasons uh, on the Dreamcast. And we're doing Pokemon like uh, with our Game Boys. Like we do the little uh, like local battles, the connections. I can't even remember what Game Boy Advanced when you could locally connect. I think you had to. I can't remember if it was like it wasn't a USB port. Firewire or something like that on those. Can't remember. Let's do that. And then um, whenever Final Fantasy XI came out, I played all the Final Fantasies, by the way. Zelda. Uh, my brother was a big Zelda fan. Uh, but uh, Final Fantasy XI, I played a lot of. Diablo 2, I played a lot of. Um, and this. Isn't Diablo 2, but I mean, it has some Diablo esque features in it, feel to it. But the only reason I think I got this game was because of Marvel. Yeah, I used to beat those dudes 100 and something to 10. That would be the average score. <laughs> Everyone except my uncle who could. He could beat me on his best day and my like okay day. Um, him and I used to have some really good games though. But most of the guys were really bad. Or they thought they were good and they just weren't very good. I remember one guy, uh, what was his name? It wasn't Steve. I can't remember what his name was. So he, he was a good friend of my uncle's. Every once in a while, he would come over and like watch us play. And uh, every once in a while, he'd hop into a game against one of us because he'd think he'd be like he'd watch us and be like, "Yeah, I got, I got them, their uh, strategy down." And he would just get whooped so bad. Um, and so these Madden leagues, when we used to do them, um, like if you were home or away, um, you would go to that person's house and play. So I went to his house, the same guy that used to think he was really good, and uh, his family was over there like cooking. They offered me like dinner and everything, and so you know me like I was like I was like 17 or whatever, and so I was just focused on like winning. Like I didn't care about eating or anything like that. So I was like, no, I'm just I'm just here to play. And so his family was so nice, and like I beat him so badly, so so badly. <laughs> It was just so, so bad. Like, I felt bad because it's like you go to someone's house, you just beat the shit out of them. And then, like, they're trying to be all, like, really hospitable. And I don't know. It was just awkward to me. It's funny, but awkward. It's like, man, I just came to your house, beat you by 100 points at Madden. <laughs> and you're offering me dinner afterwards. Ah. <sighs> 